Yo! Hey guys, before I go back, with, um, I don't know why this camera's on, honestly. But hey, um, we're gonna set a like goal today. Uh, if you guys drink water, make sure you like the video. We're gonna get one million likes. I'm so sorry. Enjoy the video, okay? <laughs> I think I might use the All Star skin. Yeah, because that one's actually bright as hell, and I love that skin. Welcome back, guys, for another video for another day. I'm your boy, Frogger. Gonna be playing some Overwatch on Table Anubis, my favorite Overwatch map ever. But yeah, um, hope you guys are having good days, good nights. And uh, yeah, let's get into the game. Frogger, you, you, play frog. What? <laughs> yes, I do. That's a nice Pokemon Widow. They, probably, they might go back and go for the res, actually. Oh, they res her. They got her. Alright, nice. Hi, Mercy. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. What's up, buddy? Alright, I think you might get with the health pack. I'm not sure. Oh, that's that's unlucky for you. <laughs> We're just staggering him. Yeah, yeah, no worries. All right, that's the biggest stagger ever. The team is gonna be so tilted about that. <laughs> Frogger? No. <laughs> yes. Hey, that's big brain as hell, dude. Okay, so here's a cool tip for you guys, right? Especially against Mei. And since Mei's really, really meta right now, this is something that you probably should really take into consideration. So if you're ever going up against uh, a Mei and she's freezing one of your teammates, the best thing to do is to hold on to Boop and wait for her to fully freeze the target. Because every single time a Mei will freeze in a spot, she'll go straight for the head. And then you can boop her up into the air or boop her back or uh, any, any position, really. You just boop her to disorientate her from like hitting your teammate in the head. And it works every single time because you're pretty much a lifesaver. And trust me, your teammates will love you if you do it. It is the most positive you will ever see teammates over a Lucio in this current Palo. Well, that's unfortunate. You've used your grapple. Oh! That was crazy, man. That was such a good shot. I'm going to get my revenge, though. I'll get my revenge. There's no way she gets away with that one. And now, we wait. They're probably going to get Sigma out, actually, so I want to get my team and just get some healing and just do some damage before they... Alright, the Widow's backed up again. That would be for my team. Let me get that Lucy over there, actually. We got Bap up. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. That's alright. What are you going to do? That Lucio is, uh, very... W Looks like he's not... He doesn't know what he's doing. We're doing a lot here, actually. Oh my goodness. What is on our way back, so... Oh! We finished it off with a clean Widow kill. This guy is insane. Holy. That was really smooth. That was that looked a little bit weird, but hey, it's all right. Hey, we're back, we're back, we're back. Oh, we'll play shields. We don't want this one to pop up. All right, we killed the carry. <laughs> we finally got our revenge, boys. Feels good, man. Is she actually? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. I thought she was cheating. She hit some really nasty shots at me, and it seemed really, really weird. That's the first hack I've actually versed in a while. I'm not really sure if she's hacking or not, but 
It's safe to assume that she might possibly be. I'm not going to say like A, but we'll, we'll see. I'm, I'll take a look at replay after this game. I'll probably like pause it during this round or something and go take a look at the replay to see if there's any proof of it. But... Alrighty, let's uh, finish this one out. On the bright side, we can't lose. And technically, if we do end up drawing, technically we drew for a hacker's sake, but we'll see. Alrighty. Let's see how we go in the 1v1s of Widow and see if there's anything fishy. We're just going to try and find out. We rotated. Nice shot. Yeah. Yep, she's popping off now, boys. <laughs> Yeah, she rotates again as soon as she knows I'm coming. Yeah, there's no way she knows I'm over here, I don't think. Woo! We're gonna take down the hacker, boys. Bro, she's one. Yeah, right? yeah. We'll see. Oh, Oh, that's a bit overkill. It's just a poor Zen, bro. <laughs> My God. He just got back into the meta. Don't force him out already. <laughs> nice. Did you? Interesting. Let's see how this looks. Yeah, let's watch it. The shot on me, well, it's just telling. Interesting. And pretty high accuracy too for scoped accuracy. Yo, what's up guys? So I just finished playing this game on the Temple of Anubis and I kind of wanted to just go over and just figure out if this guy was actually aimbotting or not or potentially uh, using wall hacks. And what I found was quite interesting, but I still don't really know if he could be hacking or not. So I don't really want to be uh, accusing people. I'm not the smartest of hacks and I don't know uh, how to spot hacks really well compared to some people who just know their stuff better than me because they verse hackers every single day since I'm not playing Overwatch 8 hours a day compared to these people. I barely run into hackers uh, compared to them. So I just want to go over something that I found a little bit weird and suspicious uh, during the replay. So it's just a normal fight going on here and you see me that I flank over here, right? So it's obvious that the Widow knows that I flanked over to this side. And what I find a little bit weird and suspicious is that um, instead of checking around the corner if I'm there, she stops and then just immediately goes for it. Now, even though she knows I'm coming, why would she even bother to check uh, like that area? She kind of just like looked at the wall, checked to see if I was actually coming or not, and then uh, figured out what they were going to do. So next they come over here, uh, grapple over here, and they just resume their thing. They know I'm still over there and they didn't even bother to check. But in this case, they do a little check to kind of just see if I'm there. Because I don't know why you would randomly just aim at this area, I guess. I, I just find it a little bit weird. But I do guess they're probably just trying to keep an eye out for me. So that also could be the case. And then they jump back a little bit to kind of just like, oh yeah, you know, he's coming, he's coming. But they stop for a second and they scope back in and they chill and watch. But as soon as I'm right at this door, he's immediately ready to uh, shoot at me. When there's no way in hell uh, they know I'm actually at this spot whatsoever. Which is something I just thought was a really, really uh, weird coincidence possibly. Or could be possibly war hacks. I don't really know because I'm not really smart with this kind of stuff. I also find that tracking really, really well done. So and it's smooth as hell and it looks really human-like. So I, I can like be a little bit suspicious of these things, right? Because first off, uh, the guide is obviously um, a level f uh, 32 player as well. So low ranks like low levels and just climb super super fast to the high like high ranks super quickly always strikes me as really really weird and suspicious especially when it's like uh hit scan players i don't really like accusating people but i do think this guy really stood out compared to other widow players i've versed in the past 
Not because of him like winning every single 1v1 against me, mainly just because of that whole situation where he was able to uh, track me well, through the wall. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you did, make sure you leave a like. And man, I've been getting full holds for the past couple of games I've been playing tonight. What's my SR right now? I'm actually thinking I'm pretty high now. Yeah, we're pretty close to 4.4, which means we are... Rank 151. I haven't been as high in a while. That's awesome. All right, guys. Once again, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for the support lately. Have a good day. Peace. Zen. Okay, this Zen's a little bit cheeky. He's kind of flanking at the time. Oh, that's good. Break, uh, break shield. Break shield. You're right. We can win over I make that. Oh. Pushing Hanzo. Hey, but oh, 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 God. Uh, Hanzo in the middle in the clock tower. Nice. <laughs>